What's up guys, it's your boy Ace coming at you again with another Madden tip and today before I get into the video I just want to let you guys know that my Twitch is now up twitch.tv slash Ace Madden I know some of you guys have been interested in watching me play for quite some time now because I haven't really streamed all year until the past week really so just putting you guys on notice that I am now on Twitch so go to the description or like I said twitch.tv slash Ace Madden and with that being said let's get into the play so gun trips YI so is the formation We'll be going over out of the Bengals playbook. And the goal of this play is to attack, prevent defense. In this case, quarter three man deep. In my opinion, this is the best way to attack it without swerving. I mean, you can swerve a little bit in this play uh, if you want. But this is best for people who really don't know how to swerve or don't care about learning how to swerve. Um, you know, I want to limit expectations somewhat because it's not going to work every single time. Which, obviously, I would love for it to work every single time. But it does a great job at getting us one-on-one -on -one with the safety. And that is the best odds we can have. So we're going to have our best wide receiver right here. He does need to be above 90 speed, in my opinion, just to ensure we get separation against the cornerback. Um, so if you have Brandon Marshall or someone like that, he's your best wide receiver. I recommend using somebody else with some more speed. So AJ Green, perfect option. And the play is going to be PA vertical shot. And we shall go against quarter three man deep. All right, guys, so what we're going to do here is we're going to try to hit X on the double move. He's going to get really good separation versus the cornerback, and we're going to get one-on-one -on -one with the safety. Once we snap the ball, we are going to cancel the play action, and we do that with RT or R2 on PS4, and just watch the pass rush. We're just going to move, maneuver around the pocket accordingly and try to buy enough time for X to get down the field. Only run this play uh, if you have about five seconds left and you're around the 50-yard line. Uh, otherwise, you might want to run another play to get into field goal range. This is just something that if you're very desperate, in my opinion, this gives you your best odds at completing a Hail Mary. So snap the ball. Hopefully Bennett doesn't get an insane pass rush like that. We have to let it go sooner than we want, but we do get the catch. He's probably not going to use her that side of the field. Two in a row. In my opinion, if it works one time out of ten, that's uh, very good in my opinion. Don't quite make it to the end zone. So that would have been worthless. Hang in there as long as you can. Almost make the catch again. So if this was on the 45-yard line, we'd be having a lot more success. Almost get it again. Run it a couple more times for you guys. And we get it again three times, and then this will be the last time right here. And almost get the spec catch animation again. So. That's pretty much the play, guys. In my opinion, it's the best way to attack quarter three man deep. Just get one-on-one -on -one with the safety, even though he has his hip squared and he's not running with the wide receiver. He's kind of watching him, so he has the advantage. But quarter three man deep is a very good defense for prevent, as it should be. So hope you guys enjoyed that play. Please drop a like if you did. Check me out on Twitch at twitch.tv slash acemadden. And as always, if you enjoy daily Madden tips, please hit the sub button. Appreciate it, guys.